Hey everyone, how's it going? Lance here. Today is Thursday, November 12th, 2015, and I'm now on, I guess, one day post-op or maybe day two. I'm not exactly sure what the exact timeline is. In my other videos, I've kind of talked about how much hair I got and, you know, where where everything's mapped out, as you can see with the with the new graphs and how and, uh, I talked about why I shaved my head, as well as, you know, why they uh, took out the old scar. So uh, what I wanted to talk about is the first night that you have your uh, transplant. The uh, first night is usually the roughest part about having a hair transplant procedure because you have a lot of pressure and it's very tender in the back of your head when you have this uh, procedure done. So I had a little bit of trouble last night trying to sleep at a 45 degree angle. And that, that's kind of tough because I usually sleep on my stomach. So what I did was that I took uh, some painkillers as well as some uh, Motrin, and what I would do is every so often I'd wake up, uh, I would take an ice pack and just kind of put it on the back of my head and just try to sleep as best I could. Admittedly, the uh, hotel I stayed at, they didn't have very good pillows. So uh, yeah, uh, you know, it's just, it just is what it is. It was, uh, you know, that's always the roughest part. I kind of remember it being like that during my first procedure a year ago. So, you know, once uh, once you get past that first night, you know, it's kind of all downhill from there and you can really start getting into the recovery process. So other than that, uh, things are looking really good. Uh, you might see this giant thing that kind of looks like a giant blood splot. That's just a scab. Uh, in another video, I'll show you guys the solution I'm using called H2 Ocean that's helping me heal the grafts to help keep them lubricated and that will help them, you know, eventually flake and crust off. So yeah, this is me on, uh, you know, the day after my procedure, and I'm going to keep doing uh, these all the way up to my 12 days when I have my uh, sutures removed, and I will see you soon. Thank you.